Yo, yo, what's up, everybody? What's up, what's up? It's your boy, Jonah, y'all, and I'm back, y'all, with another video. And also another eye-opening meshes. In this meshes, I'm going to talk about this is what happened, y'all. Never thought about put guys first. This is what happened, y'all. Never thought about put guys first. Why are you saying that, Jonah? And I'm going to tell you why I'm saying that, because... Y'all ladies out there, y'all been in the fairy tale so long. Y'all never thought about watching the news. Y'all never thought about things. Y'all been to fairy tale. You 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 want to live in a, 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 a happy land, a, a fantasy land. And you you get with any guys, and you think guys treat you more better. Let me tell you something, ladies. You need to start living the lies and you need to wake up because if you don't want to wake up, some really bad happened to you, okay? And that's the reason why y'all ladies out there are miserable. Y'all ladies out there so hurting, so bad. You just had no clue why he doing you like that. And I'm going to tell you why you feel miserable you feel hurt. You was in pain and all that stuff going on. And I'm going to tell you why. Because you never put God first. You've been on this cursed relationship with no good mans out there. Oh, yes. And see, this is what happened. You never use your head. You you know why? Because you open you open up your heart too much. You open, a, you open up your heart to the wrong man. What is you thinking? Why you open up your heart to the guy? You don't even know who the guy is. You don't have no clue. What guys operates? You don't even know he's a murderer. He's a woman beater. He he killed a lot of women. You don't even know. You don't even know he's a robber, a, ro a robbery. You don't even know the guy. You don't even know the guy don't have nothing to do with God. You don't even know this guy raping kids. So how you want? Who told you want to be with that guy? No one. It got to be the devil. And see, this is what happened, ladies. Y'all never thought about put God first. You never thought about asking God. I said, God, Lord, I'm tired of being single. Lord, what do you want me to do, Lord? Lord, what do you want me to do, Lord? I'm single. I'm single. I need a, I, I, Lord, I, I'm looking for something real. Can you find me a, a nice man in your life, in, in my life? Can you find me a man? Can you find this? Find that? What's wrong with asking God? What What's wrong with that? Seriously, what's wrong with that? God will give it to you, but I'm gonna tell you the truth. He not gonna give it to you unless you be born again. That's right. That's number one. Number one. He not gonna give it to you unless you be born again. If you don't want to do that, you just have to keep courting and just find somebody in the street. And you get beat up by the guy and you feel played out. And he would mess up your lives and he finna control your life. It's your choice. It's your choice. I'm here to help you. I'm just, I'm helping you out. I'm not Christ. I'm not Christ. I'm just speak truth. I'm just speak truth from my heart. You want to be born again? Or you want to continue to do what you do? You want God to find a person in your life, you got to do what God says. You, you got to get yourself together. You got to get yourself in order. You got to fast. You got to get this thing off of you, your attitude. They, they, need to, they need to be removed too. Cursed wig. For real. The cursed wig. Nah, they need to be removed too. Property. Uh... Hypocriting, backstabber, feelings emotional, all that stuff they need, they need to be, they need to get rid of. You want God to find a person in your life, you got to get yourself in order. You got to get yourself together. Because if you get yourself together, you ain't worrying about getting with wrong mans. I will repeat that. If you do what God calls you to do, if you're trying to get yourself together and reborn again, you ain't worrying about going through the wrong guy. You ain't worrying about Satan receive y'all. You ain't worrying about Satan sending this person to your life. 
you ain't worrying about that because because you you follow God. You trying to you trying to make things right for yourself in your own walks with God. That's right. That's right. Some of y'all ladies said, "Well, well, what, 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 Jonah? God never spoke to me." Okay, okay. Reason why God don't want to spoke to you because you got so many curses in your life they need to remove. You got so many curses in your life that needs to they need to remove. You need to fast. You got to get this thing off of your soul. The way you acting, the way you, the way you do. Some of your ladies got a bad thinking problem. You have doubts. Some of your ladies doubt God. You think God don't loves you. you. You think too much. You think God don't cares about you. You think too much. You think God hates your guts. You think too much. You think you're going to hell. You think too much. You need to stop all the thinking. You think you, the whole world hates your guts. You got to stop thinking. You got to stop thinking. That's the reason why God never answers your prayer because you do so much all the thinking. A lot of y'all ladies got a bad thinking problem. A bad thinking problem. You think too much. You think too much. You think everything's real. But it's not. You think too much. They need, they, they, they need to remove. That, that, that's got to stop. That's the reason why God don't hear your prayers. You can't get blessed by God till you're set free. You need freedom. You need to be set free when all this nonsense. Doubt, man. The spirit of doubt that needs to come out, man. That's the reason why you don't have a good man in your life because you got so many doubts in your heart. That needs to remove some serious talk. Now, more tell you this. I got I got more. Easy break up. Oh man. Y'all easy to break up. Y'all need to stop and break up, people, man. You know what I'm saying? The, let me tell you something, lady. Reason why you can't get a good man because you you easy to break up because you don't even you don't even know what you want. You don't know what you want. Why you break up with a guy? Some of y'all ladies break up with a good guy. You you had no clue. God sent this person to your life, and you break up with this person. Why you want to break up with this person? What did he done for you? Oh, he too nice and all that stuff. That's the reason why God cannot give it to you. He not going to talk to you because you break up with him for no reason. You break up with him because he ain't got no money. You break up with him because he ain't got no car. You break up with him because he ain't had no job. You break up with him because he don't have a home. What kind of stuff is that? What about his heart? What about his heart? Why you want to break up with him because he ain't... See, your problem, your problem, your ladies out there, you want to get with that guy because the, the way he got. That's, that's hypocrite, man. To me, is that's hypocrite, man. God did not say for you to do all that stuff. How, why you say you want to be with that man because he got a nice car, got a lot of money, all that stuff? Are you serious, man? Come on, man. Come on now. That's the reason why God never answered your prayers till you get, get, get your... Get your get your mind order. That's right, man. And some of y'all ladies said, "Well, JC, I'm tired of getting beat up by the guy. What do you want me to do?" I'm glad you asked. I'm glad you asked. All you need to do is start opening up your heart to the wrong guy. If you want to break up with him, all you need to do just tell him, "I don't want to be with you no more." If the dude just could come after you, all you need to do is just call the police or self-defense. Self-defense. Get your pepper spray. Get your pepper spray and get a taser. And see, y'all ladies, y'all reaping what you sow because you've been with this cursed man. Who told you to be with that guy? No one. Don't put God in this mess. God, God, God. God did not say for you to be with that guy. That's the reason why y'all get beat up because you, because you open up your heart to the wrong people. You open up to your wrong people in church. You do so much order courtship. You find somebody your own way instead of God's way. That's the reason why y'all ladies are miserable today. You want to skip your relationship? You better leave town or change phone numbers or do something. Do something. You want to skate? You better skate now. Be a woman. Say, I don't want to be with you no more. I'm done. I'm done. I can't be with you because, because you keep on beating me up. I'm getting tired of that. I'm getting tired of that. 
and, and he gonna get angry with you, you just had to find someone or get your brother and knock him out. That, you need to do something. You can't, you know what I'm saying? You can't not just be beat with that man who he treats you like dogs. No, man. You're killing yourself. You're killing yourself. You need freedom. You need freedom. If you want to stay single, stay single. You need freedom. God wants you to be freedom. Because God, because God, let me tell you something. God told Merga Magdalene. Yeshaya told Merga Magdalene, go, go sin no more. God sent Merga Magdalene free. Y'all, y'all, y'all ladies need to be free, y'all. For real. You don't need a relationship anyway. Y'all need to be free. Y'all need to be free. Do what you want to do. That's right. Y'all need to be free. You don't want to be caught up with people, relate well, on relationship with guy and all that stuff. If you if you be on relationship with guy, you gotta follow the rules. You need to start hanging out with them. Start hanging out with your friends and all that stuff. Start talking to boys and all that stuff, though. You gotta follow their rules. My goodness, man. Y'all ladies don't y'all y'all ladies don't need that kind of relationship like that. Some of y'all ladies say, well, what about relationship with men who got guns and like they have rules too? Well, let me tell you something. If you have a relationship with, with, with men who got guns in their life, that's totally different. That dude, let me tell you something. It, it, I know some of y'all ladies out there got a boyfriend who got guns in their life. Some of y'all got a boyfriend who's a Christian. You know, he probably going to tell you, you know, read the Bible. He probably take you to the church. He probably tell you not to hang around people in the world and all this stuff. Or that guy probably take you to the next level. He trying to help you in your walks with God. That was beautiful. You blessed. Some of y'all ladies got a beautiful. Some 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 of y'all ladies have a guy, boyfriend or husband who got God in their life and take you higher and higher and higher in your walks with God. Let me tell you something. You are blessed. You are blessed. You ain't got nothing to worry about. You ain't got nothing to worry about get beat up. You ain't got nothing to worry about you feel, uh, feel played out. You ain't got nothing to worry about being struggled. Because you got men in your life who got Christ. Look at me. I got God in me. You know, I, my baby mama. She, she should be happy. She should be happy. Because, you know what I mean? She didn't need to worry about. Because, you know what I'm saying? I feed her. I told her the truth about what's going on with the world. Sometimes she's satisfied. Sometimes she ain't satisfied. She want to do her. I try to tell the truth about her wig she be wearing. She get angry. She get hot about it. Because I tell the truth. I tell the truth about her wicked family members. She she understands that. I ain't going to lie. She understands that. She always telling me what she been through with her family. You know, she took she took, she took took my child. They, leave, they, leave, they left him in the state building and, 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 and her sisters stand up and take care of them and told them all type of wicked things about Jonah. Jonah did this, Jonah did that. And this really messed my head up real bad. It messed my head up real bad. It makes me go down there and slap the hell out of her. Because her sister know better. I'm, yeah, Diane, always tell them things about me. Control his life. Just like Jezebel, controlling, by controlling spirit. You know what I'm saying? And I'm and not trying to open up my baby mama eyes to see what's going on. She see, sometimes she don't see. You know? Y'all ladies out there, you need a real man to take it to the next level. See, that's the reason why y'all ladies never have a good man in your life because you never put God's first. You got to do what God calls you to do. You got to fast. You got to get this. Get this thing off of you. You know who you are. I don't know who you are. You know who you are. Some of your ladies got a nasty attitude they need to remove. Some of your ladies got so many issues in your life they need to remove. Some of your ladies got a bad thinking problem they need to be removed. Some of your ladies wear a wig they need to remove. Some of your ladies to be evil and for, uh, 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 lust. All that, all, your, all that stuff ain't got to you. Mean spirit. Jealousy, hate, lustful, sexual, all type of all type of stuff they need to remove. You need to fast because God did not gonna let you to the kingdom of heaven unless you were born again. That's right.
That was in the Bible, not a man. I'm just speaking truth from my heart. It's up to y'all. If you want to continue and want to um, be with this cursed man, hey, that's you. That's your freedom. You want to be with a cursed man, go ahead. You're going to get beat up the rest of your life. You're going to get stomped. Sometimes some men's kill women. They got some men's killing women like crazy, man. For real, man. And I, and, I, and I was out here in San Antonio. Somebody somebody told me women's got raped in the shelter or outside the shelter, whatever. Some women's get beat up by the guy. Such, 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 that. And I say, man, I ain't trying to hear that, man. Women's, man, women's need to wake up, man. If you don't wake up, killing yourself. See, y'all be into fairy tale too much, man. Y'all be into fairy tale. Yeah, you got to stop living in the fairy tale. Get out the fantasy land. Fantasy ain't get you nowhere. Because you're going to be setting up by Satan. If you live in a fantasy land, you'll be received by the devil. Because the devil comes at you, y'all, as an angel of life. That's right. It is, I'm telling you the truth. It is the truth and nothing but the truth. When y'all get yourself together? When y'all going to get yourself together? Or oh, some of y'all say, well, I'm going to do it tomorrow. No, tomorrow is going to be no more promise. And, that, you know, that's the reason why I'm doing videos to put out there. This is why happened. You never put God first. That's the reason why Satan sent a person to your life. You get beat up. You be miserable. Come on now. Y'all ladies, y'all need you don't need none of that stuff. Come on now. Y'all don't need none of that stuff, y'all. And that's all I'm saying, man. This is your boy Jonah, man. I'm just hit y'all some true stuff, man. Put God's first. Obey God commandment. Follow his will in your life. Go through the fire with Christ. You want God to bless you. You want God to talk to you. You got to do what he calls you to do. You got to be born again. That's all I'm saying. And that's all I got to be saying. This is Jonah, y'all. I'm out, y'all. Peace. One love. For y'all ladies.